my name is Charmaine and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time visiting, thanks for stopping by. Today I'm going to show you how I designed that mug in my thumbnail. It's a coffee mug. So I'm going to go ahead and go push the upload. We're on the Cricut Design Space. Okay, I'm going to choose my um, image from my recently uploaded image. So uh, right here. I'm going to go ahead and click on image, insert image. Okay, for the mug I'm going to use is this one right here. You can get mugs anywhere. And this mug is, let's see what size. This is. I usually measure it, measure it with the tape, measure so I can know what size I want my image to be. So four, so it's, um, the, the height is four inches. So to make it fit, I usually do a three and a half, we can do a three and a half by three and a half. Let's see the height. So let's do 3.5 height. And let's do the width. Let's unlock it. Make it a little wider. So I'll probably make this like a, hmm. Oh, let me see. Three and a half. Yeah, three and a half by three and a half be good okay so she looks something like this i'm gonna squeeze her a little bit she's look too wide so i'm gonna use her like like this so her um it's width is 3.3.3.307 by 3.45 close to four five okay now you see over here she's all ungrouped we want to go ahead and ungroup her and then weld her together so we can be able to have less cuts than this there's a lot of cuts over here so if you want to know more about how to weld and cut, you can look at my other videos. I do a lot of layering videos to show you how to do this. So first you're going to do is go to ungroup right here. And then we're going to um, take her apart. Oh, the rain is coming down. Okay, so there's her glasses. We're going to move her over so we can have some room. You want to highlight her again and go to ungroup again like every SVG is different this is the SVG we working with and everybody has you know they design it differently so when you start to ungroup and weld things together you will see the difference in the SVGs okay so this is a different um, designer I'm using so I'm pretty different from the regular ones which it looks like it's a little easier so what I'm gonna do now is choose the colors I want my vinyl to be so I'm gonna keep this black her eyes are gonna stay white this is gonna her skin is gonna be a little darker brown but i don't have to worry about that because i know what color vine i'm gonna put on here her glasses i want her glasses to be a different color i want her glasses to be glitter and i want her shirt to be glitter so since it's already blue and it's the same color i'm gonna keep that the same color because i'm, I'm gonna put glitter on the mat not blue oh these are two different blues right okay so i'm gonna just make sure these are the same color blue so they can be on the same mat and i'm gonna put pink glitter vinyl and this, I'm going to use the pink glitter vinyl too to match her, um, to match her shirt. So I'm going to also put blue there too so it can all be on the same mat. And this is her cup. Her cup, I'm going to make the cup gold. So I'm just going to put, let me find a gold color. Mm, yeah, this one. Look yellow, but so I'm going to make her cup gold. Okay. So... This is how it's gonna look when it's cut out. So let me go ahead and to make it. Make sure it's down off the line so I won't cut cut it off. Our skin. Like I said, it's gonna be a darker brown, but that's fine. Okay. So let me go ahead and get my mat together. I'm gonna show you how to use the mat because these are small, these pieces are under four inches long. Or why? So I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do my use my mat. I'm gonna show you a trick real quick how you can cut with multiple multiple pieces of vinyl on your mat. Now let me show you what I'm doing here. This white is gonna cut first, and this is her eyes right here. Then the black, which is her hair, I'm gonna cut on there. And then this cup, this her skin is gonna be the brown right here. Then her cup. 
it's gonna be this color. Then I gotta reload the mat and then um, use this color for her um, hair accessories, her glasses and her shirt. And let me show you, how, let me tell you how to do this. First, when you, um, let me go ahead and try this one, cause it's gonna be our first one we're gonna do. Then we go to continue. And then I'm, the blue tube is getting ready. Finally, my um cutter, my Cricut. I'm gonna do one, then I sh and then I um do the rest by myself, just to give you an idea how to do it. Go ahead and cut on that piece right there. Those are the eyes. Okay, now I unload it. And I'm sure I gotta do now. So that is done cutting. If you want to, you can go ahead and take that off. Or you can leave it there, it doesn't matter, I'll leave it there right now. And then you see this black right here where it's placed at. So when I'm going ahead and go on the computer, click on this, edit it, push edit. Then just move this over here to the side so it'll print on this side. Okay. And then done. And now I'm going ahead and upload. I'm going to go ahead and push the, um, I already uploaded it. Now I'm going to have to push the C so it can go ahead and start cutting. See how it cuts on this side now because I positioned the image on that side. This is how you cut on multiple, with multiple pieces of vinyl on your mat. You do the same thing for the next two, but I just flip the mat over so that side can go in first. This side can go in first. Make sure that the measurements is correct because you don't want the cutting to go outside of the of the paper of the um vinyl so make sure you measure and make sure you have the, enough vinyl to cover your whole image so usually i cut a bigger piece just in case to make sure i have enough on my mat we know the eyes was not going to be that big but i still cut it the, um cut the vinyl a little bit bigger just so i have enough space i know the skin is not that going to be gonna, i know the skin is not going to be that big but i still did it just to make sure Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cut these out and I'll be back. Okay, I'm about to go ahead and start weeding everything. It's really, really hard to see this vinyl, the um, the, the objects and the glitter vinyl. It is very hard. I was just trying to figure it out. It's gonna be tough trying to find a little old hair pieces in there. So let's go ahead and do her um skin first. Go ahead and weed this out. We can cut the excess parts that we don't need just because it, is, so it won't get in our way. So we always keep a picture up so you can be able to see what needs to be weeded out and what needs to stay. And you know on your um, design, Cricut design space, you will see all the um, white needs to come, come out. Okay. Okay, so that's done. Now let's do her cup. Let's pull it out. This is the cup. That's all we need to put a cup. Then her eyes is very small. So I cut all this out. from the part that you don't need the outside part and just pull it off. Keep the eyes on there because we need those eyes. Of 
have everything weeded out. Weeding can be a booger. <laughs> it was really hard getting it, um, weeding it out. So let's go ahead and get this cup. We got a cup, and what I need to do first is spray it with alcohol so it can clean the surface and then wipe it down. So where I'm gonna put my um, image at, my SVG. Wipe it down with the cloth. Put it about right here, probably. I like to place the cup like that so I can be able to um, get it, the, the knob, I mean the um, handle, but I'm gonna keep it sturdy. Okay, so let's go ahead and put the contact paper on the, the first layer, the bottom layer. Should have brought it down some, but it'll be okay. Mm. You don't want it too close up to the lips part when you put your lips at. And there we go. A few bubbles. So what I'm going to do is take this thing I got from the Mod Podge and see how that took that bubble right out. Just go ahead and do this real quick and see they're gone. But you got to do it quick. And in the right position. Okay. So that's the first layer. The second layer, which is her skin. As I was recording this video, I accidentally muted my phone, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you what I'm doing next. Basically, I'm getting the, the cup to put on top of her cup, the color. There you go. And then I'm going to go ahead and do the shirt next. If you like the content in this video, please subscribe and push the bell so you can be notified when... I upload more videos. As you can see, I forgot to put the glasses on her face, but she's still beautiful. Thanks for watching. See you next time.